Star. No catfish. No, not catfish. Cat food. Ooh, what are you? I got caught you before. Yeah. Oop. Well, I don't know if I caught you either. No, I didn't. Cool. Oh, what is this? Looks like there's something here, like a hole. Ooh. What's with that strange coral? Ooh. Is that a friend? Nope. <laughs> I will find you, and I will kill you. Not a fan. That was mean. Ah, that octopus that sprayed me with ink. Just wait till I catch you. Here I come. Oh, it's gonna lead me to the hole? Yeah, it is. I finally caught up. You stay right. There they go. Oh no. It escaped through a door crack. I don't think I can fit in there. Think of it. I can probably use a gas cutter from Delft to cut my way in. Just you wait, you octopus. Let's go. Gotta get revenge on that octopus. We're gonna make it into Takoyaki. Mm, it all tastes delicious. He said it already. Let's go. I got you in my sight. You. You got nowhere to run now. Give up. I guess I'll have octopus sashimi for dinner. Bye, have a great time. Oh, we definitely can't fit through that. It escaped again. So quick. Oh, what's that? Drop something. It seems to be an artifact. I'll have to identify it back at the surface. Cool. Alright, let's go. Cat food? Oh, high quality cat food. Mission success. Please go to sleep. Yes. Ooh, rank six. Yes, please. You're gonna make a lot of people happy today. Yes. Is there more jellyfish around? I certainly hope so. Rubber chicken. It's not entirely clear whether this is suitable as a weapon. But try swinging it anyway. Just do it. <laughs> I love that. 
Any more jellyfish for me? Oh, just that terrifying thing over there. Which I don't think I'll have room for anyway, so I'm just gonna leave it alone. Let's see, where is... Ah, there's more jellyfish. Yes. Come to Papa. Bunch is gonna make you into this delicious sushi. Ooh, heavy. Okay, let's uh, let's discard that. Hmm. Cuttlefish is heavy, man. Yes. Okay, so point four. Hmm. Point four. Oh man, I'm gonna have to do the blue shells. See where? Oh, I gotta get through the the tube. That. Oh, is that fish? Okay. Oh, let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Let's try the Sea People Translator from Dr. Bacon and see how it works. Uh, uh, can you hear me? What? How is a human speaking our language? An interesting creature. Its body looks different from that of the humans we occasionally see. Well, in any case, right, I should introduce myself. My name is Suwam. Among us, low dwellers. Oh, you said you call us sea people, right? You could say I'm the bravest and coolest male among them. Ahem. Su Wong. Nice to meet you. I'm Dave. Aha, uh -huh, Dave. In our language, your name sounds very similar to Broken Toilet Seat. Or Broken Toilet Lid. What is th what is with this creature? In any case, the person lying here is the daughter of the sea people's village chief, Ramo. Ever since being kidnapped by that stupid giant squid, she has been unconscious. If I would known about it earlier, I'd have shown that squid a, a thing or two. Don't get, don't get a big head for defeating that insignificant squid, human. I'm the one that guards Ramu. You really are a noisy one. In any case, you seem to have something to say. What is it? Oh, about that. In order to allow Ramu to recover, we need some medicinal herbs. I'm unable, un blah, blah. I'm unable to leave. As I must stay and look after her. Oh. Human, you must require some medicinal herbs to help Ramo recover. Oh. The feather coral and lily coral grow in these parts. Please make them edible and bring them to me. Feather coral and lily coral. Mm. Make them edible? How do I do that? Oh. As for you to figure out, human. Go find a chef to help you or something. Mm. Uh, she's ill, so I can't refuse to help her. Feather coral and lily coral, huh? I guess I'll take a look around. Alright. Let's go. Lily coral and feather coral. What do they even look like? Let's go through here. That recover. Oh gosh. Oof. Oh, that's an Opa. 
It looks like a sunfish. This is the first time I've seen one in person. Maybe I'll take a picture as a souvenir? Oh. Will it come back? Optional goal. Capture two opas at the same time. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. No, I'm gonna retake it. I'm gonna retake it. Come on, baby. Where are you? Where'd you go? Oh, that's just one. Big one. Should be coming around. Come on. Oh, I missed it. No. <laughs> Gotta take a perfect shot. Nice. Let's -a go. I need to get rid of 1.3. Get rid of this. Uh, oh, this is a big skeleton. Another entrance way over there. Cool, cool. Let's find us a pod and go to Boncho. Phew. Seems I got everything that fussy half fish asked me for. You wanted me to make this coral edible, right? I'll have to ask Boncho for help. Well, what does the ring do? Bracelet found in the corner while chasing a nasty octopus. Use. L3 dash a short distance. Is there a dodge? Equip the octopus bracelet to dash a short distance with L3. No oxygen to use, but the gauge needs to fill again for the ability. Cool! Oh, you brought a picture of something? Can I see? Ooh, an Opa! Did you know that the Opa is warm blooded? Oh, I think I've heard about that. Uh -huh, it's amazing that some fish species are warm blooded. The ocean is full of mysteries. I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. Nice. There are photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help and keep up the good work. I wonder if I can call Boncho about that. Or I might just bring it to Boncho. First. Let's... And then go. Oh. 
Sushi. Hmm, <coughs> so this coral has to be prepared so it's easy to eat for sea people. Well, I think we could start with Forge of Swords. Give me a moment. Oh my gosh. Nice. Here we go. I softened the coral to make it easy to eat. We should be fine. Wow, thank you, Pancho. You're so quick. Alright, let's take this to Ramo. Let's go. Ooh, what's going on now? Ooh! Hello! Yo! Look at that! Wow! The humpback whale! It's so big that it makes the blue hole look smaller. Can I take a photo of it? Going, sir. Get away from me, I'm looking for the shark. Oh, no, no, the whale. Oh, is it gone now? Darn. I hope we meet that again soon. Ooh! I haven't seen these before. Go to sleep, go to sleep. The poncho can cook you. Yes. Oh, thank you. I'll, I'll probably just take these like this. It's only one quality, but you know, better than better than nothing. Ah, yes. Oh, those purple fish? Oh, I've caught them before. I thought they were new. No, I don't got time for you. I only got time for two things. Ramo and jellyfish. Ooh, and catfish. <laughs> Not catfish. Cat. I keep saying catfish, but I just want cat food. So I want to keep feeding the, the the cat. Yes. Any of those? Sh yes. I might actually catch capture that. Oh, that thing's fast. Hello, sir. So I saw jellyfish, so after I get those jellyfish, I'll go to Ramo. Hey, Suwam. We got the food. Here, I brought some coral forage. Oh, ho, you really brought it? Oh, seems to be right. Ramo, this is coral porridge. I prepared it myself. Bruh. I feel much better now. I can't remember anything after seeing squid tentacles. Oh, a human? What is a human doing here? Well, you could say I saved you. I defeated the giant squid and brought you the coral porridge. 
Hmm, is that so? Wait, Ramo, that's not it. I'm actually the one who... Alright then, human. You shall escort me back to my village. Me? Why should I? I'm an injured lady. You need to keep anything dangerous from happening. Ramo, I can escort you too. Suwam, you go ahead and scout our path. What? How could you let a human escort you? I can keep you safe and... You haven't even passed the village tactics exam. It was tough enough coming here. Oh, that's a sore spot for me. Suwan, stop complaining and be our lookout for the path ahead. As for you, human, you'll have to carry me on your back. On my back? It's hard enough to move around as it is down here. Oh, my injured fin is hurting again. I like that she's like, like looking, like, you know, like side-eyeing. Oh my gosh. You're impossible. I'll take you to the village and no further, alright? Bye, Suwon. Alright. Get to the target location safely with Ramo on your back. Ramo has the ability to open up two warm paths. Watch your surroundings carefully and escort her safely. Okay. I'm glad I got the frilled shark to begin, to begin with. So we gotta follow Suwon. Alright. Let me open this up. Ramo releasing them two warm pheromones. Hey Suwon. Good. Follow along. Make sure Ramo isn't hurt. Oh, he can also do the two warm thing. Let's go. Another danger? What is this vibration? It's rare to experience one so strong. Something happened to the village. We must return quick. Hurry, human. Okay, let's go. Hey now, human. Don't tell me you're tired already. Bring her carefully. Let's go. Now, wasn't this where there was the... the, the sealed up cave? Was that not it? Oh. I do want to take one of these. Now what's down? Oh, another. Wait, what the heck is that? Stay here. It's a small shark thing. Cutter shark. Oh. Shovel. Okay. Oh, Sue One, where are we headed to? We're getting to critical depths here. What's that? 
Ooh. I want to see if I can. Yeah. Come on, go to sleep. Ooh, blood jelly comb. Jellyfish. Ooh. <clears throat> now let's go. Just gonna skirt on the the ceiling in this. Isuwam. Ramo, our path is in is blocked with rock. Oh my! Oh no! What's going on? Uh, it must have been the vibrations earlier. Isuwam, think of something. I need to get back quick before my father scolds me even more. Hmm. Maybe we can open up a path by dropping the loose rock pile over there? If we can topple it and make it fall, it might just do the trick. Well, I suppose it might, I suppose it might work. How do I make the rocks fall, though? I see a stake over there. Maybe if we pull it out? Human, can you pull out that stake over there? The stake? I think I'll hurt my hands with the gloves I'm wearing. Probably do with do it with the gloves that are thicker and offer a better grip. Dave, my apologies. I left the microphone on because I was dying to know what you were talking about. If it's enhanced diving gloves you need, I think my lab could help you out. New gloves? Aha. Uh -huh. Equipment goes hand in hand with exploration, does not? Come up to the boat. I think there must be a way. You should wait here for a moment. Hold the human. You plan to leave Ramo in a dangerous place like this? Luckily she has me guarding her. Still, be back quick. I'm sure she'll be fine. Hmm, the road back to the Sea People Village, huh? How fascinating. My lab has developed some diving gloves to be used for retrieving artifacts. I see. That should let me pull out a stake without my hand slipping, right? Uh huh, of course. It has a ver very safety measures built in that'll let you move many other objects besides stakes. The long dive must be must have been tiring. Get some rest. I'll explain the details tomorrow. I'll come to the boat tomorrow morning. Nice. Oh look at that! There's like fireworks going. Oh Dave, are you busy? Not at the moment. What is it? We have a strange customer at the sushi bar. You should come over for a moment. As the manager, this is something I can't overlook. I'll come over right away. A noisy customer. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that. Disco time. Oh, huh? little kid. We haven't opened yet. Oh, hello, kid. Um, You look like a student. We haven't opened yet. Come back a bit later. A fool. Listen, you. I heard you the one time, so stop blabbing. What in the world? I'm sorry, it wasn't me. You rotten blowfish, you. Get me food. Food. What in the world is going on here? I think I've read about this somewhere. There's a therapy method that involves letting traumatized kids speak their mind through dolls. Doll, how dare you? You idiots don't deserve to live. Dang! Kinda mean. I, I suppose it could be something more complicated. Let's ask, let's ask what she wants first. Kombu and White Tree Valley Ochazuke. I want it. I do. It sounds like something older men would want. I don't know what's going on, but we'll have to give her what she wants for us to try and have a conversation. Kombu and White Tree Valley Ochazuke. Let's check the ingredients first. Do we have it? Yeah, we do.
Okay. Well, let's add a few of those. Or right, let's just leave it at one. And who are you? Oh. Huh? Who dares interrupt me? I'm sorry, we're not open yet. Can't come in like this. Well, aren't you strict? I was simply saying a few words. I haven't been to the beach in a while and brings back old memories. <laughs> I was an amazing diver. Well, I was an amazing diver before. Before I took a harpoon in the knee. So you were a diver. I'm also a diver. Aha. Then you must know the diver's dream of swimming in all the seas of the world. Forests of coral, pots of sperm whales, fights to death with tiger sharks. Hmm. Mm. That brings to mind a, a dish I'd really love to eat. What dish do you mean? When I was little, the moray eel curry at my fishing village was famous. Mm. I can't forget its taste. If you can make that dish, perhaps I'll give you a nice gift. Haha. <laughs> mm. Moray eel curry. Moray eels hide in the rocks, making them difficult to catch. How do you get one? Ah, you know how to dive, but you don't know much of the ecology, do you? Moray eels are nocturnal and only come out at night. Oh. <laughs> Do you have the gear for night diving? Oh, I did get a flashlight recently. That should do it just fine. <laughs> moray eels are nocturnal. Please go night diving and catch a moray eel to fulfill my wish. Mm. Alright. I haven't gone diving at, a, at night for a while. Maybe I'll try it. You can now dive once every night. There are many vicious nocturnal fish out at night. But you'll also see exotic fish. Always pay attention to the sushi bar's opening hours. Cool. Alright, let's get things set up for the party. What was this? Yeah, this one. Let's set up five of those. jellyfish hmm. one more we can sell it for 500 each let's do that Ooh. I'll just enhance it oh my gosh uh I don't know if um, all of them is going to sell within the time. I'll just keep that for now. Any other jellyfish? Meh. Now that should be good. Hmm. Let's see. Ooh. Learned Puffer Nikogori. Oh, we can make puffer fish stuff now. Alright, that should be good. Where, where's Momo? I guess Momo's hiding because they're not allowed to be during opening hours. Let's open things up. Let's get ready, everyone. Welcome in, welcome in. Oh my gosh. Was that delicious, huh? Oh, well, why are you crying suddenly? It's too good. 
you. This is way too good. Damn it, it's too good. It reminds me of my father. What's going on, kid? My name is Maki. I'm looking for my father. My father left the Explorer Depths, but I can't get in touch with him anymore. His favorite food was kombu and white trevally ochazuke. And I heard you sell it here. I thought he might have come by here. That's a pity. I'll be sure to tell you if we see someone that looks like your father. What is that doll? This is a Cleone plushie. My father gave it to me before he left. Oh, I have a favor to ask. It's about the Cleone. I've never seen one in person. Could you catch one for me? A Cleone? We can't catch something so small with a harpoon. What do we do? Can we use this? A bug net? I think it might work. Alright, I'll give it a shot. What are you doing, you walrus? Get your tights on and jump in the water. I'm sorry, I can't control my emotions that well yet. Oh my gosh. Alright. Cool, 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 cool. We got so many customers. Holy crap. Ready. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Come on, Dave. You got this. lot of jellyfish too. Oh my gosh! That's so much money! Oh my gosh. Wow. That was a success. Holy cow. Thank you. 